You guys asked, and I'm here to answer. Let's make a gear shift head out of our cast Choya skeleton. Let's begin. First thing we have to do is we have to cut it to length. I'm gonna put a clamp around the bottom so that as I'm cutting, the saw doesn't grab right here and want to twist it like that because there's no supporting uh, material underneath. So once it hits the blade, it will want to bring it downward. My current gear shift is approximately three inches long. So let's cut a three inch length off of this and go straight to turning on the lathe. And you can see right from our first cut, here's, our, here's one of the bad stress fractures. Again, it just cured too quickly. Then when the inside went to shrink, the outside was already hard, so it had to pull apart on the inside. Oh well learn something new every day. So I found out that my old gear shift head accepts a five inch uh, shaft. So right here I have a five inch four square bit. We're gonna turn it and get a hole drilled. We'll put a tailstock in and then we'll uh, start turning it. Huh, okay, well, that just chipped out. We'll work around it. I just got a, um, a plastic bottle. Cut out the cylinder part. Mm -hmm. shot of your head. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome.
something all right. Looks great too. Here you go. Here's the old one and the new one, if you couldn't tell the difference already. Very, very cool. Let's see if we can get focused. I'm aware that the internal cracks kind of came through right here, uh, straight down the middle really. This one comes straight down the middle, and this one in the back comes at a kind of slant. But I do not think they're connected. So I'm not worried about the sh uh, breaking off when I'm shifting gears. Uh, I'm pretty much reassured by the fact that the shaft of the gear stick comes in, you know, almost, what, 80% of the way, if you can see, comes up to right here, all the way back. So it's got all of that space, or all that, um, all of that area to give it extra strength when I'm moving it. But really cool, you can see the grain structure, or the fiber structure of the Choya along here. Pretty cool, I like it a lot. And, I also have this two and a half inch block left. Um, this is the top section, so it would have gone like this. Um, so, I'm gonna ask something of you guys. I'm gonna ask, what should I turn with this? Should I make another gear shift? I mean, good for my friend, he drives a stick, he drives a stick as well. Should I turn it into a spinner? Should I turn it into a tiny little bowl, I mean, you know, whatever, whatever you think you, you can think of, comment below and uh, let me know what you think. Otherwise, very happy. I'll be putting this on shortly, and I'll be using it uh, right after this. And I'll, I'll be driving tonight, so it should be fun. I like it a lot, and I'm happy that you joined me. So if you like this episode, give me a thumbs up and uh, share it with somebody else. If you, you know, and remember to share the video as well really helps me out and uh, comment uh, what you think I should turn out of this piece awesome. well thanks for thanks for joining me thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next video